Hey, where are the people traveling with you? I thought you got people traveling with you. <laughs> hey, I saw Esther's profile. Wait, did you equip anything or like look at other stuff? What? She, she has a little penguin guy. My the two series that I do have so many different. You only said half a sentence. Okay, she has a harp. That thing has no weapon. Give it a weapon. Give it a weapon. Give it a weapon. Give it a weapon. What? Oh, no, you already have that equipped with a different guy. So you need to get... You need to get weapons for that thing. An armor. Not this one. Yeah. I'll take it off since I don't use it for attacking. Okay, that's smart. There you go. Oh, kitty doggy. She has a harp. She has magic power. She's a slow attacker and a fast mover. Did you see that? Yeah. That makes her attack go up, so you don't want that for her because she is not an attacker. I'm gonna give it to someone who's an attacker. Okay, where do we gotta go? We gotta go to a volcano. Volcano? Yeah, remember? Or or like a trials place. Maybe it was a trials place. I don't know. There were some people talking about volcanoes, and then her dad was talking about a trials place, and I thought it was a volcano, but maybe not. Maybe that was just like the kids talking in this town. We do have to go to the trials place, wherever that is. New, 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 new. Whoa, he's coming. Yeah, he's following you, remember? That's why I said, where are all your other people? This is the first time I've been out of Alma Moon in ages, Oliver. <laughs> and you sure do look happy about it. Esther, the purpose of this journey is to take the trials. You're not wrong, man. This isn't the flippin' day trap, you know. Get moving! All right, all right. Lead the way. That's the spirit. Now, let's... Hang on a minute. Did that sound by there just move? Flippin' dead, man. It's a monster, in it. Right then, Ollie boy. Since you're gonna be fighting with Esther from now on, I better teach you some new moves, innit? Ready, you two? Yes! Now, you and Esther can fight together, man. Double trouble, Tidy. Now, there's two of you. You can pick who leads the battle when starting by pressing L or R. Why don't you give it to go, eh? Go on, pick Esther. Esther, it's my turn. Now, Esther's in charge instead, see? She's what's called the leader now. And the leader can boss everybody around. See the tactics command down by there. Pick it and you can tell all your butties what you want them to do. Easy peasy. And to change leaders mid battle, just press L followed by a little tap of the old up or down arrows. Now get out there and enjoy being a gruesome twosome. You can say do what you different do what you like. Do you want to attack different targets or the same target? Or you can say give it your all, which would mean like he's gonna use all of his MP right away. Or provide backup, which maybe means like kind of do stuff based on what you do. Keep us healthy is gonna be heal, that's easy. Don't use abilities means don't waste your MP. And don't do anything. Means just stand there and die. And you can attack different targets or same targets. What? Cut loose hurts everyone? Well, that's why it's good for them. She's so weak. She actually switched to her little guy, yeah. Stop using cut loose! Why is he giving these a cut loose? I don't know. Literally, the order is not to use cut loose. No. Do you have a magic attack on that thing? 
Oh, you should have attacked the other guy earlier and run HP, but he got it. Oliver's halfway dead, though. He's got to be careful. Wait, did you hit B or did you hit A when you chose his orders? A. Because maybe, like, you exited out. You exited out without hitting OK or something. That made the battle easier. Fine work, Oliver. Your magical abilities are indeed impressive. As is your report with your familiar daughter. <laughs> I do my best. You know, Oliver, I'd love to try to fight fighting with your familiar sometime. Huh? You can do that? Of course. All you need to do is switch your familiars around. Just select friends and familiars from the main menu. Trust me, it's really easy. Select a familiar and press Y, and then choose where you want it to go. Do that and we can swap familiars! Gee, that's pretty neat. I, I had no idea. <laughs> yes, you can control my Drongo as well if you like, Oliver. In fact, everybody has a type of familiar that they get on especially well with. Use that type of familiar that's right for you, and their performance will be that much better! You can check what types of familiars you get along well with by selecting the Friends and Familiars menu from the main menu. Right, enough chat chat, you two. We need to get to that Temple of Trials, and it. Indeed, it is located to the northeast of the Shimmering Sands. I suggest we head there immediately. All right. You're going the exact wrong way. Jaxter always forgets about his map. Why do you always let them get behind you? <laughs> Guaranteed lose it every time. Run! No more lose hits. Oh, she healed you. That's good. Uh, you don't have to focus on it. But you do need to attack. Oh, you ran. Jackson, you need to attack! She's losing! Help her! Worse having someone else, right? Why? Because you're hurting them extra. Look at that, 46. Because now there's so many people who um, could die now. Nice yeah, but there's also so many people who can heal now. And you can hurt the enemies more. Could you imagine trying to fight all these guys all the time by yourself? Ice cream. Oh, an item. Water. I think you can get some ring water over there instead. <laughs> the big old desert. Where are you going? You need to go to the star. Downhill, because in real life, downhill makes you go faster. You know, Cooney, no matter how big the downhill is, you do not go faster. Which is weird, right? No. Old game mechanics can't incorporate all that. Jackson! Why? You stopped running. Just turn around Let's before they get to you. Uh-oh! Paralyzed. That's bad. That was punching you in the face! Fire rank! Fire rank? Bro, Frank is fast. Good hit. Good show. Salted ice cream? That sounds disgusting, right? We got salted ice cream with pieces of super, super dark chocolate. That's disgusting. I outran 
land something for the first time. Isn't that crazy? Isn't that cool that I outran something for once? Yeah. It's supposed to be faster. Let's go! That sun blazed you. You're gonna heal. That's gonna heal! Lose the heal. She's gonna die. She's gonna die! She's gonna die! It can't even move. The computers get hurt so much and don't even have MP anymore. They only use magic, right? I guess tell her not to use magic, but she needs to heal. You need to get a better healing scheme. But healing's magic. Yeah, so you need to be able to figure out a way to get her more healing. Actually, you passed it. I'm there trying he to. Is. Trying to be ahead. Beat him! No. The Temple of Trials lies on the other side of this gorge. Perhaps it is a good place for a moment's respite. Wait, wait, Dad. What's that? A sparkling thing. Look, there's a creature on top of here. Where? Oh, yeah, look at that. Maybe it's a buddy you can get. Flappadakman! Am I glad you suggested that? I'm a forest fairy, me, me. And My and fairy suit isn't even soundproof. Oh, I'm gonna get a climbing ability, I'm done. We're stopping already? But I could go on for ages yet. Really? You aren't even a little tired? It's so hot. Hmm. You will endure far worse things at the Temple of Trials, Oliver. Geez, so the trials are pretty tough, huh? Indeed, that is why you must get some rest. I will keep watch, you will sleep. And stay close to the fire. The desert grows cold at night. Alright, Mr. Murshad, sir. I wish it could actually be night, right? Yeah. Oliver? Hmm? What is it, Esther? Why did you set out on this journey in the first place? Most people wouldn't dream of taking on someone like Shadar. Well, uh... It's my mom. I have to save her. Your mother? Uh, yeah. She... She died saving my life. But Mr. Drippy says there's a way to help her here in this world. So, you've come here to save your mother? Yeah, I guess. Wow. Huh? Doing all this for the sake of someone you love? I just think that's amazing. I wish I had as good a reason as you for making this journey. <sighs> oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean I wish that... It's okay. But... Shadar is incredibly powerful. He breaks the hearts of anyone who defies him. So no one dares to resist. And they say no one can defeat him. I know that. But... I have to. You have to try, right? I... yeah. It's so strange. You don't look powerful in the least. But somehow, I just know you can beat him. I wonder why. Th thanks. Anyway, enough of that. It's late. Okay. Good morning, Oliver. Did you sleep well? Uh, not really. I guess I'm a little worried about the trials. Oh dear, well I hope you won't doze off in the middle of them. Though I have to say, I didn't sleep very well myself. I kept thinking about that girl. My other self. It's so strange. She's not like me at all, but it doesn't feel like she's a different person. Well, soulmates are funny like that, ain't it? Different but the same. There's profound. <laughs> anyway, we are. we best be off, Oliver. Oliver! Esther! 
The Temple of Trials lies north of here. The tests that await you are unforgiving, but I have faith in you. Thank you, sir. Let's go, Oliver. I want to show you how brave I am, just like Myrtle did. Okay, so that thing's a bad guy. A new story. Temple at last, the trials await. Limey, it's proper impressive this place, huh? Shrouded in an air of potent mystery it is. Did you expect anything less from the sacred haven built to train the mighty sages? You train here, Mr. Rashad? Of course! All who bear the name Sage must pass the trials. So Alicia would have taken the trials too. Oliver! To become a sage, the candidate must possess purity of heart, breadth of knowledge, and mastery of both spells and familiars. The temple both tests and tempers all of these qualities. And if we can't pass the trials, there's no way we'll ever be able to beat Shaddai, is there? Precisely, but even the gifts granted to you on the passing, on passing the trial will not be enough. You will need far greater power to defeat the Dark Jinn. Well, I guess we'd better just focus on the trials for now then, huh? You are ready. It is time to release the seal. Beyond this door waits the Supreme Sage. It must be opened by your own hand. Yes, sir. Wait, did you save before you came in here? Um. Remember you can save out in the open world? But it's fine. You probably can save in there. I hope. Oh, there you go. Uh, we are... So this is the Supreme Sage, is it? Ahem. <clears throat> Your Honor, we have come to perform the trials. Not... me. Huh? huh? Idiots! Oh. I'm the Supreme Sage! Oh! That's just my stupid servant, Umboka! <laughs> what? Huh? Crikey, we got the wrong one! It's just a sweet little boy. Sweet? Oh! Oh, I'm sorry, Your Honor. I don't care. I am sweet and clever and handsome. I'm just so modest. I don't like it when people call me that. I, um, I see. How did you lot get in here anyway? Only people with my permission are allowed to open the front door. It has been a long time, Your Honor. Is that you, Rashad? Blimey, why did- when did you get so old? You're ancient! But you have not changed at all, I see, Master Solomon. Did you know my father when he was young? <laughs> How strange! Eh? Father? You mean you're- Yes, Your Honor. I present my daughter, Asta. 
Please forgive her rudeness. <laughs> I don't care. What I care about is having a daughter. How did that happen? You are always so shy and rubbish. Oh, well. Congratulations. Anyway, what are you doing here? What do you want? These children, Master Solomon, Oliver, and Asta, I would like... I would ask that you allow them to take the trials. Really? If you're recommending them, you must think they're pretty good. That or you've gone bonkers. I see great potential in them both, but they lack power. Beginners, are you? And you want to get stronger? Why? What for? I... I need to... I need to defeat Shadar. What? You? Beat Shadar? You do realize what you're saying, don't you? Yes, Your Honor. And I'm going to help him. Oliver helped me, and I'm going to pay him back. Fine. But the trials are hard. Really, really hard. I know, because I made them. We're ready, Your Honor. <laughs> it looks like you might be. Okay, I'll let you do them. Thank you, Master Solomon. We'll pass all the trials. You'll see. You have my thanks, Your Honor. Then I will take my leave. You're going already? Boring. You should stay here. What's wrong? Scared to see them fail or something? He's right, man. After all we've done for you, the least you can do is stick around and see these two through the flopping trials. I cannot. I have duties of my own to attend to. I will not remain a Babana seller forever. I must prepare to walk the path of the sage once more. That's not the real reason, is it, Father? Why are you so desperate to go home? Don't you see? He wants us to take the trials without any help. We have to prove we can make it on our own. You're right. Okay, Oliver, let's do our best. Good luck with your preparations, Father. Don't sell all the babanas, will you? Of course not, my child. When you complete the trials, you shall have all the babanas you can wish for. Good luck. Come on, all this talking is boring. Let's start the trials, shall we? Go up and ask stupid old Umboopa about them. Umboopa will explain the trials. You will listen. There are three trials. The first trial is the test of wits. The second trial is the test of friendship. Pass these trials, and there is a third trial, the test of strength. It is the final trial. But first, you must pass the first two trials. The first two trials are in the trial rooms to the left and right of here. To learn about these trials, ask the trial monitors in the trial rooms. Good luck in the trials. Now you can save. Wait, save first. This is a save game. with two characters. Oh, it's gonna be hard. Go! Jetra, go! Go! Buddy, what you're supposed to do is you're supposed to do the exact opposite movements. Do you see it? So, you're supposed to do the exact same thing, but then, like, your left and right, yeah, opposite in both hands. 
See how it's like showing you clues? Yep, so go in. Yep, do the same thing. Stop! It'll create a path. So the paths get different, but if you do the same thing with both characters, then the path should always be correct. If you do that, you'll probably be too slow. Run, Jackson, run! Run! Double run! Ah! Actually, you have to, when you get there, you have to stop and go horizontal. Go up, horizontal. Straight up. Straight up. Don't, don't, you're going sideways with Oliver. You gotta go straight up. Go in, inward. Oh, you missed. You lost. Oh, you're lucky. Oh, it's slow. Come How it's slow? You can just probably do one at a time. It's so slow. You were only controlling one at a time. How'd you fall? Because I was doing both. Ah, that's the part I was doing both. Oh, maybe they don't. I thought it was mirroring, but that is not a mirror at all. Okay, why did it get so slow at the end? <laughs> Oh! I don't know. Is there no checkpoint? Quick! Go! Run! 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 This is a turn taken one. Go fast enough. Wait, did it restart? No. You almost fell. You took a breath. This one looks like opposites. Maybe this one. Oh, oh, tricky, scary. Can he do it? Oh, can he do it? It's tricky, scary. He's getting the hang of it. Good job. Good job, Jack Stolliver. Faster! <laughs> you. When they switch sides, you push left for the left hand instead of the right hand. Falling a little faster. Remember, you can do one at a time, too. How you did the last time? What if this is the easiest room? Probably is. fell through her floor! If this was in real life and you just fell into a dark, infinite pit. In real life it would be easier though, right? right? Maybe. What if you had to control both bodies at once?
You've fallen at that spot like eight times in a row. That's why you just run up. Just run straight up. That's why the bridge is there, so that way you just run up to get out of the bridge. Not sideways. There. Oh, good job. One. <laughs> what if there's a boss behind the door? And if you lose, you have to do the maze again. Excellent! You have demonstrated the strength of the bond between you and passed the test of friendship! I hereby present you with their proof of achievement! Stand together in the face of hardships that await you and believe in one another above all else! Do so and you'll always prevail! We will, thank you very much! Winner! Secret character! Next one! Save! 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 And I gotta go to the right door! I bet you could see my back. <laughs> ah! Test of wits. What does it even mean? Wits are like how smart and clever you are. Well, Matt, this is the test of wits! Powers of perception and reflection are the keys to solving these puzzles. Show me the wisdom upon which your kind prides itself of, child of man! Gotta put them on the right one. Is that what it means? Remember, it said something about a mirror reflection. Oh. That Solomon's. Click. How am I gonna? Yes. What's the rule again? What did it say? Why don't you do the thing that you were gonna do? What? You can't? No. Can't push A? I clicked A, B, Y, and A. Okay, well, why don't you look at the ground? If there's a question mark above your head and you can't hit A, then what do you think ground is telling you to do? I should be clicking A, right? It, literally, there's an A, right? Oh, no, that's not an A. How is this not an A? What do you think you do? Just pushing A over and over will definitely not do it. I'm clicking every button. You're not. You can even click one right button. R, L, R, L, Z, R, Z, L, A, B, 
Stick, stick. Up, right, left, down. That's not even every button. You missed half your buttons. What do you mean? What button did I miss? You only did all the triggers, A, B, and the arrows, and then start and minus, or plus and minus. And R, L, Z, R, Z, L. Those are the triggers, I said. So what would I do? Why'd you just go back before you even finish the right button? Jaxter? Uh, what does the ground look like? An A. Circle. What do you have to do every time you get to a new place in this game when something won't work? Click buttons. No, what thing does Oliver have to do in order to get new areas and do new things every, every time you get somewhere? A spell. Do you see it, viewers? You can't leave a comment until Jackster turns 13. But do you see what he's doing? Did you see the A? That costs your MP to do this, too. Then you can fail. Oh, other one. The same one? Actually, look, the buttons that select statue are arrows, see? Did I do it? Incorrect! Tallest to shortest. So just the shortest to tallest. Oh, you got it. Why did you get it? I don't even know why. It said something about reflections. But I didn't see reflection anyway. Unless it was like to put them in reverse order. Whatever they just did. I don't know. This one's easy looking. What to do right away. This one's super easy. You think you can figure it out?
Oh, it's for what I see right now. Ah, I, thought ah, I, I thought it was. Ah, I thought it was gonna be for what you see. Ah, if you're in a different spot. I thought it was gonna be for if you were in a different spot. Ah, well, it's actually you've got a round piece, so you should only take it where there's round stuff. This one's so easy! How is he not getting it? How is he not getting it? What? What? That one, what? Why do you keep moving it when it's right? Oh no. That one left. Is it this? Okay, do the last one. Jackster, why'd you quit? I did it. No, you right. did it. How would that work? You missed the fifth statue. Jackster, that one was correct. Yeah. You didn't do the last one. Which one? This? Yeah. These types of puzzles and games are very hard for kids. Dad had some games when I was 10. Super hard puzzles and I used to have to look online for help. All right, I have no idea what to do here. What, what symbol was that? Star, 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 moon, 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 sun, 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 and then something else. Oh, I bet I get it. Maybe. Maybe not. Huh. I was gonna say maybe the symbols are like their elements and they fly like a ground one and a fly one and a fighting one. But that's not because it's just sun, moon, and star! I probably have to like go in the corners or something. Oh! Wait a second. Is there one that has four symbols? Because three, 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 four. Which one has four symbols? You have to cover all four of those. It's four statues. What's underneath? Neath? What's underneath the mighty? Sun. So then there's four suns. Maybe you have to cover the four suns. Obviously, got to be on a sun, right? Oh! Oh, maybe it's their types? I get it. Maybe it matches up with their types. It might use a sun type. Sun is good against moon. I think that bird is a moon type. Of course. That little dog thing. Wait, but what would moon be good at the sun? Wait, couldn't you just like look in your monster book? Or buddy, there's four of them. Why don't you put them all on suns and see what happens? On suns? Yeah, because there's four suns, but there's only three moons and three stars. Yeah, that's not it. Womp womp. 
Why don't you look? Don't you have like a monster book where you can see what signs they are? I'm out of MP pretty much. Well, you can get it back when you go to the other room. You know, in your menu. Look at your book. It'd be in the journal, not that book. Oh, maybe it would be in that book. I think you're right. Look, creatures. Yeah, chapter five, creatures. One. Click on, just click on something. So those are types of, not, not that, not a legendary. Yeah, no, click on, click on that one. Okay, look, those guys, huh. It doesn't say anything about suns, so you gotta look somewhere else. Wait, just look at Mighty. See what he is. Okay, so that sun symbol. So we gotta look for those symbol things and see what they do. What is that? Star? What is the next guy? Star? What is Esther's guy? Moon. Okay, so... Sun, moon, and star. Yeah, maybe you're right. Something with sun, moon, and star. Alright, what do you think you're gonna do? Might, you might be right. You might have to put them in the order of like the weaknesses, but how do you know what the dragon is? The dragon? It looks like a star or something. The Almighty is obviously... Sun. Mighty is a sun, but which sun? Maybe you have to do those four lines that are connected to each other. Sun, moon, star, sun. So maybe the dragon, yeah, the bird you think is a moon, so put it down the bottom moon. And then put the little guy, the regular guy, the, the wolf, the wolf, or the dog, on the star. The star's probably just like a regular guy. No, the connect, yeah, the connected star. And then put the dragon on the sun and see what happens. High sun that's connected. So that way they're all connected. The one that's connected to the other three. The sun that's connected to them. Nope. Well, there's only one thing you can do, and you know what that is. What? What is it? What do you have to do to figure it out? So Jack's to the sun. Star. This one's star. Uh, it can be a sun. It should be sun. Jaxta. What? What do you think you have to do to figure it out? Something that you didn't even do in this room. There's gotta be something. Yes, but how do you know the correct answer? You're only looking at those four characters over and over again. What about the other character? What do you mean other character? The other character in the room. Jackson, what are you missing? You're not gonna probably be able to just figure it out randomly with those four characters, because that's so many. Firebird. Huh? The firebird. Yeah. So bird's gotta be fire then. No. That has nothing to do with it. What? What? What do you think you have to do with the firebird?
statues aren't going to figure it out on their own. It's too many options. What? Fire burn? This... That bird has nothing to do with the other bird. The other bird is what you need. This bird? Yeah, the two birds are completely unrelated. So what am I supposed to do with that bird? Yes! Can't move it. What did it say? Yes! Good. You didn't learn anything about this room yet. Yeah. So what does the bird say? What do you require? You didn't get the hint? How are you supposed to know anything about the room? Oh, now you know about the room. The bird is bound to the dragon and moon. And on a star he sits. The beast links warrior moon and star, yet knows not where he fits. Okay, so the bird sits on a star and is next to the dragon and a moon. But the beast is be is between moon, a star, and the warrior. Eh? Oh, I get it. Okay, don't forget all the things that it said, buddy. I don't even have it remembered. I should have taken a picture. So, Jaxer, first, the bird sits on a star... And is next to dragon and moon. So which star could it be? Can't be that star, there's no moon next to it. Okay, so then where does dragon go? Oh! Alright, and then the beast is next to warrior, moon, and star. It doesn't seem right. How could the beast be next to a moon and a star and a warrior in the spot that it's at right now? That's not right. Look at the beast. Is it sitting next to a star and a moon and the warrior? with three sides. Now is it is it linking a star and a moon and a warrior? It's linking a star and a moon. Still linking a star and a moon, but the owl also needs to have a moon next to it. Remember? So the beast needs to be next to star, moon, and warrior. After all, be touching the beast. Is the warrior touching the beast now? Now you got it. Excellent, you have demonstrated your wisdom and passed the test of wits! I hereby present you with proof of your achievement! The gaw! Ah! Keep your eyes and ears ever open, the knowledge you will gain, you gain will serve you well! The gaw! There's not always brute force that wins the day! Often the word is mightier than the deed! I understand, thank you very much. Okay, now you can go and save.
You passed the first two tests, not bad. Now we know you're good friends and you're not completely stupid. And we also know of my powers of encouragement and support can work miracles, Tidy. Hey, I had nothing to do with it. Anyway, Oliver, it's time. The final test. Where, what is it, Master Solomon? Ha! Everybody knows that! It's the test of strength, stupid! This is a test of your combat ability! You've guessed what you have to do, haven't you? We're gonna have to fight somebody, huh? Oh, aren't you clever, but not as anyone! <laughs> You're going to get your heads beaten in! Oh, but I didn't want him smashing out the place up, so I've prepared a special place for you to fight in. Anyway, you probably need a rest first because you're so small and weak. I'll be waiting here when you're ready. Yes, Your Honor. All right, Jackson, what do you want to say, everybody? Hope you have a good day. Bye. Bye. Say.